Today's quick tip, talking about the second blind spot I see foreign musicians having when they are playing Brazilian music. Uh, it's about harmony and uh, often jazz players use the rootless voicings on the left hand uh, with the tensions and some Brazilian styles doesn't accept this so well. We have to take some, we have to be careful. Because, for example, melodies of Shuro are made by arpeggios. And when you play, in, uh, in the case of a uh, major 7th chord, A major 7th chord, you can create some shocks with the melody. Alright? So, uh, there are other kinds of harmonic solutions when we play simpler melodies. And we can sound modern, we can but they are not the same as jazz players would use. Another situation happens on the treatment of the chords with uh, inversions. These are very common chords on Brazilian music that we use. Uh... situation like this with a lot of inverted chords uh, the rootless voicings won't work and simplicity and another specific solutions will help you to sound modern and good all right so pay attention in these characteristics that are very common in Brazilian music uh, and pay attention if you are sounding inside of the style you are playing all right so I hope I have helped you and create more awareness in your playing of Brazilian songs. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. To my style, 